Hi, I'm Darren. Hi, I'm Gordon. And we're the Two Gay Reefers. Hey Reefers, if you hadn't noticed by our videos that we've been doing recently, we're trying to become better reefers. The whole sump clean out video has been a great success and the little improvements we're doing has encouraged you guys to do the same. So it's great to see us coming together as a community and sharing ideas. As you can see by these comments here, 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 and even over here. So with that in mind, we're going to replace our old filter socks with some new Red Sea Filter Cups first in Australia. We're going to put them through their paces. Let's roll the tape. This is a Red Sea solution to get rid of filter socks. So we're getting rid of filter socks because this is like a couple of days worth. At the moment, our tank is needing these replaced about every three days. They're increasingly getting dirtier and dirtier and really need replacing soon anyway. So, excited to open these. Let's have a look and check it out. So they're a nice tall cup. So that gives you plenty of options there. So each cup also comes with a media bag as well, which is really, really handy. At the moment, I think we're gonna run carbon in both. Having tested our tank on the weekend, our tank is actually looking good. We've got nitrates coming down, phosphates are coming down, our alks at a good level. Today we're using Red Sea Respect Carbon. The carbon is a little bit damaged on the outside. That was because of Bella. She thought it would be something yummy to eat. So she tried it and realised, no, not for me. So let's have a go at this. So we use approximately about 50 grams of carbon in each one. Okay, we have our cups. Bag of carbon in each. This way, hopefully the bag will stay nice and clean and it'll be the filter wall here that collects everything. So what we're doing is rolling it up into a nice little tight cylinder. Pop it in there like so. So I'll just make sure I wash out these with some RO to get rid of any silt, any air bubbles from the carbon. But they're ready for the sump. Ah, uh, the lovely sound of a clogged up filter sock. As you can see, this is how clogged up the filter socks get. So here we go, they just simply, ooh, they fit in perfect. So it fits in there nice and easy, and there we go. So just notice due to the width of our heater, it gets in the way of putting these cups in. So we're gonna have to work out something here because our heater is currently too long for the sump now. We'll put our marine fuel box back in place. Alright guys, so we've had the uh, Red Sea filter cups for about a week now. Uh, they went in last Sunday. Uh, we're taking them out for the first time to see how clean or maybe dirty they are. I uh, have to move a few bits of uh, of uh, stuff in the bottom of the tank first so we can get them out properly but uh, let's just see how they go first thought so far is that they've actually been very quiet all week um, hasn't been a lot of uh, extra noise that you normally hear in the tank so it's definitely uh, helped in that uh, it looks pretty pretty cruddy but I guess that's just easily easy enough just to wash out So that's the uh, the carbon in there in its little bag. Oh, it, stinks. <laughs> it stinks, is it? So it doesn't look like they're going to come completely clean. 
but I guess it's only cheap wool, we can just replace it every sort of second or third time. Leave them for a little while to dry. That's it, simple as that. So the Red Sea filter media cups have made a big difference to the sump. They're a lot cleaner than the filter socks and a lot easier to use, don't you reckon? Definitely a lot easier to clean out. Uh, not that I do the cleaning, he does that. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the videos. Please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the uh, notification button. Give us a big thumbs up, a big like. Uh, it definitely does help. Definitely does improve our, uh, our ratings. Ratings? Ratings. Ratings? Anyway. Be excellent to each other and keep it salty, everyone. See you next time. See you guys. Bye.